Hello to all NSEAD trade union members and welcome back to an autumn term where the main topic of conversation in staff rooms is the fact that for the first time in two decades, national strike action by teachers is a very real possibility. You are no doubt aware that teachers in England, Northern Ireland and Wales have been offered pay increases that are way below the level of inflation. And in fact, they constitute a pay cut, not a pay rise in real terms. And this is despite the fact that the profession was widely applauded for the efforts and sacrifices made during the pandemic to keep children learning and to keep schools going. You may feel that the pay being offered is a scant reward for those efforts. Teachers are leaving the profession because they can't afford to stay. We've got a recruitment and, and retention crisis and it affects schools and colleges throughout the UK and it cuts across all subjects. It's a crisis caused by low wages and the soaring cost of living. Everyone is feeling it and the squeeze is not just on our wages but also on the funds that schools and colleges have got to warm the buildings and just keep the lights on as winter approaches. The funding is a very real concern. The fact is, there's been no extra money given to schools to cover the inadequate pay awards that have been announced, let alone to pay for a decent pay award that's a fair reward and a fair wage for the work that teachers do. As schools and colleges struggle to meet rising costs, education and the children that we all work for will suffer. They are suffering. And without extra funding for schools to pay the additional wages, cuts will be made. And we know that it's the arts that are generally first in line when difficult decisions are being made about finances. So NSEAD is working alongside the other education trade unions, and we're exploring what action might persuade governments to fund the paying conditions that you deserve. NASUT, the NEU, the NAHT and Community Voice, they're all consulting with their members uh, with the intention to strike or take action short of strike, uh, disruption, work to rule, uh, other, other ways to uh, disrupt. Now, NSEAD will work alongside our sister trade unions, but we will remain independent and we will make decisions that are in the interests of our members. A major issue for us is that any pay award must come with that additional funding. Without it, any increase will be a hollow victory for NSEAD members, who we think will be vulnerable if cuts have to be made to pay for the pay increase. So we'll work first and foremost with you, the members, to work out what action is right for you. We are a community of specialists and we have got very particular needs. We've also got very special talents. And I know that when we come together as a united voice of art, for art educators, we always punch above our weight and we make sure that our interests and the interests of our subject are on the table. So it's more important than ever that we stand together as a specialist community. It's more important than ever that we keep you updated and informed so that you can make your voice heard and make the decisions that are right for you. So what do you need to do now? Well, first of all, make sure that we've got the correct contact details for you. Make sure that we've got your email, your phone number and your home address. You can go on the, uh, at the NCAD website and log on to the member portal and check the details that we've got and make any changes that you need. You need to keep your eyes open for updates and key events. We'll be sending you newsletters 
and emails throughout the autumn term. And you need to tell us what you think. So attend online meetings, send us your thoughts via email, on social media, or just pick up the phone um, and, and make a call. We need to speak to you, we need to hear your thoughts. And finally, stand together and be ready to vote for the action that you want if and when the time comes. <laughs>